Thank you. So I continue the, the, the lecture yesterday. So I just uh, recall the, the, the plan. So, <clears throat> so we are in, uh, studying this gradual quotient. And uh, we already seen that uh, how, how we get this, uh, uh, the gradual quotient is RBM. And uh, we are in, in, the, in the course of proving uh, to show that this gradual piece is actually a F FP vector space. Okay. <clears throat> and uh, after that, uh, <clears throat> I will talk on this character form. But maybe I, I, I give more. Uh, for, Practical information for the hike tomorrow as a guide. <laughs> <laughs> so, to, to be sure that you, so this is very important. So, you, you have, you, you, otherwise, you will get very extremely thirsty. Okay? <laughs> and uh, if you don't have a prepared uh, bottle, uh, we are in the film. And uh, so, we, we from the gate, we, we walked like this. So we, you, you can go, go, go down and cross the street, and there's a big building, and uh, you enter in a big hall, then you will find a bending machine. Less than that. <laughs> yeah, it's in, on, on campus. So. It's on campus. Don't be... Just on the other side of the... Yeah, it's still in the campus, so it's not a big walk. Okay, so, so let, let, let's record where we are. So we are studying the gradient quotient. Gradient quotient. And uh, R is uh, at least one. And uh, <coughs> I, I do larger than one. And uh, we have seen uh, already uh, abelian, and uh, so we want to show that, show that this is uh, an FP vector space. So, so to, to, to work on this, uh, <clears throat> so we already know that this is a uh, <coughs> finite uh, P group, and in fact, uh, abelian. So this we have seen already. And we know that we may assume this uh, sub, this is trivial. So the, this uh, grade piece is uh, in fact uh, this piece, the last piece of the filtration. And to study this, we constructed yesterday the, this finite uh, finite data. Okay, and uh, further, uh, we take some uh, embedding of our color extension to sufficiently large field. <clears throat> then, uh, this, using this, we can focus on the, the connected component. Containing uh, this point, <clears throat> then uh, we get uh, finite et al. Uh, so this is a finite et al. Uh, G, G R to sa. Oh, I like this. <clears throat> and the fiber is in fact the orbit of uh, orbit of uh, this chosen. Uh, <coughs> In the most uh, chosen image embedding. Okay, and, and this, <coughs> so this GR Tosa uh, defines uh, injection uh, from the. So I'm not sure if I wrote the GR here, but if, if, I, if I didn't write it, it was a mistake. So I have to put the GR here. Injection to the uh, H1. Of theta zero, also here, and uh, the one over p divided by z. So we, we are studying uh, this one, <clears throat> and here this theta zero so 
So theta zero is, is just a vector space. So let me recall that theta zero is a home space over f prime of this quotient of tau one omega one over k okay, is f prime. And uh, <coughs> r prime is an integer. <coughs> uh, so we kill the denominator by multiplying the, the ramification index. So we are in, we are in this situation. <coughs> OK. And now uh, I, I extend the scalar to theta 0. So, so this is over uh, f, f prime. So I just take, take base into f bar. Then uh, simply uh, f bar. And let me uh, introduce the notation in, in one minute. So this part is the same thing. This total part is, is the same thing. So we, we just replace uh, f prime by f bar. <coughs> and this <coughs> mksr is uh, the ideal of the ring of integers in a, se in a separable closure. Uh, where uh, the, the variation is uh, uh, at least r. And if you put the plus here, then you replace, you, you remove this uh, <coughs> uh, equality. <coughs> okay, so we have this uh, uh, <coughs> de description of the target of this uh, cohomology. Uh, uh, sorry, uh, this uh, vector space. Okay, so now, uh, so this has a functoriality. Of uh, this morphism. So we use this functoriality to, to prove this property that uh, this graded quotient is killed by P. Okay, how we do that? Uh, so what, what is this functionality? So, so we have this uh, finite, this is our, our finite color extension. So I take uh, some extension of, so this may not be finite, but uh, extension of this, Hensidian, this, this is the variation in field. Uh, may, need, need not to be finite. And for simplicity, I assume that the, the ramification index is one. Okay. <clears throat> then uh, we have, we, we can take the composition field. Okay. <clears throat> then uh, we, we need the commutative diagram for this most. <clears throat> okay. So, G, R, check. H1, theta 0, f bar, uh, z, 1 over p, divided by z. And so we have injection here. And we have similarly uh, Galois group g, Galois g1 here and z here. And the ramification index is, is uh, so ramification is the index is one, so I, I don't need to, to change the, uh, so this is confusing, so R and the check. Yeah, okay? <laughs> and then check. So again, we also have injection, and H1, uh, theta 1, 0, uh, F1 bar, and 0, 1 over P, divided by P. So we have this, such a uh, functionality.
Okay. Now, uh, suppose if Yeah, so this is just a base, yeah. Yeah, after you put the but it still remains the injection. Oh, okay. Yeah, so if, if prime is arbitrary, so... Mm. Mm. Okay, so suppose... Uh, suppose we have, so now we use our cotan vector space coming from the cotangent, com cotangent complex. So in, in the, at the end of the last, uh, second lecture yesterday, we, we have studied what is this F bar vector space. So this, is, this was the replacement of with the cotangent space. And suppose, so, so we have a map like this by function of reality, so S1 is a spec of K1. <clears throat> suppose this is an injection. Okay, and also, <clears throat> and uh, suppose we, we already know that uh, P times, uh, P kills this, this last piece. Suppose we, we already know our uh, assumption for, for big, big one, then, uh, then we, we can conclude that uh, P also kills what, what, we, what, what we want. So, so because, <clears throat> so this theta zero has a de the decision like that. So this is a, some twisted tall one. And we, we, we have seen yesterday that <clears throat> Uh, yeah, this so one is the subspace of this H one. Okay, so this this injectivity means that uh, <coughs> theta zero. So we have a uh, map of schemes. Ah. Sorry, I, I, again, I have to put the uh, dual here. So because we have injection here, so the map of scheme, schemes is, so this is a surjection. So, and this surjectivity, uh, or, or uh, yeah, uh, this, uh, sorry, this is dominant. And because this is, this is dominant, the, the map here is also injection. This, uh, this implies that the injectivity here. So once you, you get the injectivity here, and you get the injectivity there, and uh, this assumption implies that assumption, this conclusion. So, so to, so to prove this, we just need to find uh, K1 satisfying this property. So for, for this thing, uh, we have a lemma. <laughs>
uh, there exists k1 over k such that uh, ramification index is 1. And, and, and uh, this map is an injection. And uh, the residue field is uh, perfect. <clears throat> so I don't, I don't prove this lemma. So this is uh, not, not, so, not so hard, but uh, it requires some preparation. So I, I don't prove this lemma. <clears throat> but uh, so. This assumption means that we, we go back to the classical world. And in the classical world, we, we know what, what is the uh, upper number ramification, uh, upper number infiltration. So it's just a renumbering of classical, uh, lower number infiltration by uh, L1 function. And uh, using this property, we, we uh, so, so this implies uh, perfectness implies this condition, so so we get this assertion. So this is uh, the 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 goal of the, the the second part. Okay, so the, yeah, the, the, this introduction of the cotangent complex uh, allows us to to prove this property. Okay, now uh, I go to the last part. So, any questions so far? Yes. Hmm? Ah, this this construction. Okay. So yeah. So you just uh, yeah. So suppose you you are yeah for simple yeah. For simplicity, so you suppose you are, you are so we are in, in a we are in an equal character space, and uh, suppose our field is like this. Then you can simply uh, take something like that. And in mixed stochastic, we, we you construct something similar. Then now we, you get this. Okay. Ah, no, this, 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 yeah, so, sorry, this is, not, this is not to correct at all, so, so I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, ah, yeah, you, you have, you, yeah, we have to do it a lot more, more carefully, yeah, I see. Uh, mm. so, no. Uh, so you, you have to introduce the uh, keep. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, we put. Mm. Ah, <laughs> sorry, I, I can't re Yeah, I cannot recall precisely, but. Uh, so you, you, you take extra, you put an extra parameter, and. Uh, yeah, then, then we, we, we work, uh, yeah, it, the idea is to, 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 we need to kill, uh, yeah, so d, dx will be, uh, uh, w, d, d plus, d, 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 w, and, uh, and, uh, yeah, so you want to, you want to keep this, so we, <clears throat> so we want, we want to somehow uh, p p p join p, 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 p power of, uh, p, p plus root of x, but uh, do it more, more, more in, a, in a clever way, so that uh, we, we, we keep, keep this guy, but uh, we kill uh, the, 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 the other guy, yeah. Yeah, so sorry. And so, so I think, uh, yeah, so we, we, after this, we, we, we uh, yeah, we, we kill uh, w, w by 
E, yani after this you, 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 you can use this guy like that. Yeah, I'm, I'm sorry. Okay, so uh, there is an, uh, another question from Zoom. Uh, yes. Yeah. Is, uh, from offer. Uh, yeah, so the, the yeah. you said that the map is uh, the map is dominant on the level of those affine spaces, uh, one over the big field into the small field, and you deduce that the map on H one Z mod P to the M is injected. Yeah. So uh, can you show it on the black? Uh, where is the black box? Uh, huh? It's written somewhere on the. Okay, so so I I in, the, in general you. It's not enough to know the map is dominant to know that H1 is injected. You need that the, that on the level of function field there is no there is no ah the the, the injectivity, injectivity here yes. yeah yeah so yeah you, 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 you have to the, yeah yeah you yeah we we have this so this we have you use that this is a vector space so uh, so we have a, a exception of this this is this H1 as as using artificial uh, yeah. And uh, yeah, and uh, yeah, or so to, to have an inductivity here, uh, so we, it, it's enough to, to show the inductivity on the, on the FP, FP question. And uh, then we can describe this as uh, using Artian here, and, uh, and uh, using uh, the inductivity there, uh, I, 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 I show that the in, the map on the H1 FP question to the injection. Uh, ah, okay. Mm. You can use translations to reduce yeah. to, to things which are defined by linear. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, yes. Okay. Yeah, you, I, I compute everything very explicitly for this H1, and then uh, I, I check the injectivity easily. Okay, okay guys, mm. I think I get the point. Yeah, thank you. Okay, yeah. Thank you. Okay, so any other question? Okay, now I go to the last part. Okay, so so this is uh, it again uh, on, on this uh, injection. So I, I put I put I put uh, uh, Z1 or P, P over Z there, but uh, now we know that uh, this uh, this gr group here is uh, killed by P, so I, I can just put here FP. But uh, this group is too big, uh, but, but uh, so we know that this is injection. So the, what what we want to show is that this is in fact uh, contained in the, the subgroup. Uh, like this. So, so this is uh, the group of extensions. All of algebraic groups. Okay. So let, let me describe, let me tell you how, how they are different. In general. So, yeah, this is, this is a vector space of a field of character, algebraic closed field of character P. So, in general, for K will be algebraically closed field of characteristic P. And V will be a K vector space. Of finite dimension. <clears throat> then, uh, so we want to, yeah, and the V check will be the dual, uh, regarded as a smooth group scheme over K. Then, <clears throat> so this is just a spec of uh, symmetric algebra 
over V. <coughs> then, by Artesian area theory, this is a quotient of this symmetric algebra by the full brilliance minus one. Yeah, so I, I, I show this injectivity here using this description. And in fact, this extension group is, so this is a polynomial algebra, so they, they may have a <coughs> higher degree, but this part is just linear, <coughs> linear forms. So, uh, using this des description, uh, so this, this is identified with, uh, <coughs> yeah, theta zero. The dual of theta zero, so this is just the home of M, MK bar R, MK bar R plus. Uh, this notation I just uh, introduced today, and the total one. <coughs> Yeah, it's still there. Mm. Uh, OL, omega 1, OL over 1, OK. F1. So the identification uh, is obtained by putting back the sequence. Uh, so this extension group uh, classify extension like this. And if you have uh, element of D, you can regard it as a linear form uh, to GA. And on GA, you have a Argentine sequence. So if you have an uh, element of D, then you regard it as a map from Vtech to, to GA, and you can put, put back the, the, this Argentine extension uh, to, to get this, this class E, and you, you, you get uh, the extension class here, and this, this map to give us the required isomorphism. So now our goal is the following theorem. Three, that the image of the map above is in fact lies in this extension group. So once we, we get this, uh, we get a map from he, here to, to there. So I by defines uh, injection uh, from <coughs> GR check to, to this group. <coughs> Or, uh, so we have seen that this total one group is a subgroup of the, the homology group of, of cotangent com complex. So let me write more precisely. <coughs> H1, L, F bar, over S. So, so this is a, a map called the character form. So I call this a character form because uh, this, this, this one here is something like a differential form. <clears throat> so as I said, this is a, the, a replacement of uh, 
uh, cotangent space. So, so, so we, we may regard the element here as uh, some, something like a definable form. So, <coughs> so I, I call this character form. Okay, so how we prove this? <coughs> this, uh, this fact that the image is contained in this text group. So we need to show that <coughs> so this so this map is, is it, this class is defined by uh, this fin finite etalomorphism. Yeah, so, so this is a GR Tosa. And what, what we want to show is that uh, this is, in fact, this is an extension of this vector space by this finite, finite F vector spaces. So need, need to show uh, that <coughs> So psi zero carries uh, group structure. Uh, such that the most above is a group motion. A group scheme structure. And GR is a kernel. So what we want to show is that, uh, so, so from the beginning, a priori, uh, this, this is just a uh, finite term motion. But in fact, uh, this carries more structure that uh, the, the source is a group scheme, group scheme and the, the most of is preserves group, group structure. So then, I don't have uh, time to prove everything, so so I, I, I just want I, I just want to sketch the proof. In some special case. So first of all, <coughs> characteristic of uh, cases positive and uh, R so R is uh, must is uh, any uh, positive rational number but uh, I assume that R is an integer and moreover uh, I assume that uh, here in, in a geometric case so K, K is the fraction of the hensonization of some, some smooth scheme. So X is smooth over a uh, perfect field. Perfect field. Okay. And the uh, design is uh, the Z point. Of some divisor D. <coughs> some smooth some, some divisor. Okay, so we will focus on this geometric case.
Then, <clears throat> so we want to find some group structure. So the, our, the, the question is where the group structure comes from. So we have to, we want to find the answer to this question. So the answer is that the, this coming from the group point structure. On uh, the self product. <clears throat> so this carries a uh, natural group point structure. So let me remind you that, that what is a group point? Okay. <clears throat> so group point is uh, <coughs> some category uh, where <clears throat> uh, every motion is uh, isomorphism. So most likely, uh, group point is, is uh, just a category where uh, <coughs> every isomorphism is a, every morphism is isomorphism. And uh, as uh, you you consider a group scheme out of uh, abstract group, you can also think about a uh, group point scheme out of out of uh, group point. So it has many uh, structures. So, so first of all, you have a source and a target. So this is a set of set of most most ones, and this is a set of the object. But in fact, so we regard them. them as, we consider a scheme schemes over K and most of schemes over K. <coughs> And this plays a role of source, and this plays a role of the target. And also, you, we also have unit, unit motion. And, and, and we, we, in group point, every motion is an isomorphism. So, so we have <coughs> inverse, in, the, the inverse is defined. So and uh, I don't I don't like that the, the, uh, the axioms, but uh, group point, group point over k group point scheme over k is uh, such, such uh, data uh, satisfying certain uh, satisfying uh, certain axioms. <clears throat> Yeah. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank, thank you, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> thank you. Yes. So I have to take <clears throat> uh, fiber product, and uh, so here uh, the map here is uh, so you source and. Yeah, to, to define composition, the, 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 to, the target of the first motion must, must be equal to the, the second, source of the second, second motion. So you really have to take five product like this and the composition is defined like this. And, and they satisfy certain actions. So let me give you one example. So, yeah, I, I, I said that, uh, X cross X carries natural group group point structure. <clears throat> ah, before giving the the example, so in in, in the special case where S equality, then then we we, we go <clears throat> S S equality, then then we recover a group. Uh, over X. 
Okay, so example. So here m is x cross x, and uh, so we have uh, we need to have uh, two map. Uh, the source is the first projection, and the uh, target is the second projection. <coughs> okay, now what is uh, this uh, composition? <coughs> Yeah, so in this story, I have to write like many X and many crosses, and it, it, it is, <laughs> it is rather confusing. <laughs> over, over X, right? <laughs> so, and, and uh, the composition must be the uh, map from here to there. And uh, <laughs> And uh, the, the point, so here we have a first projection and a second projection. So this product is uh, x cross x cross x. Okay? And, uh, and the map here is uh, the, the projection taking the first component and the third component. <coughs> Something is wrong. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. I have to switch. Yeah. Okay. Huh? Yeah. Yeah. You don't see what? Yes. S and S and T. Yeah, S and T. Yeah. Hmm? S is the source and T is the target. Not Saito Takeshi. Okay, so this is the first, first example. Okay, now <coughs> we, we are interested in, interested in the ramification. So, <coughs> so we have a smooth divisor. And we have this multiplicity. And I assume that this is the integer. So let me write R, capital R to be this multiple. So this is the Cauchy divisor. Then we can introduce a, a, a datation. So oh, this is uh, open sub-scheme sub of open subset of this blow-up. So this, to define this blow-up, let me draw a picture. <clears throat> so, so we have uh, x cross x. And uh, this is uh, R cross X and X cross R and the diagonal. So the intersection here is uh, R embedded in, in this X. <coughs> so X cross X, this X cross X prime is a blow up here. <coughs> so after blow up, So blow up at So we get uh, proper, so they are proper transform. <clears throat> so we remove these proper transform. And, and, and here, uh, are, this, this R is a divisor, so blow-up doesn't change this diagonal X, and we, we still have a diagonal embedding. So, so this is our uh, P of R. This, this is our dilatation. And so, so, so we have a, uh, natural map 
from VR to this X cross X. And uh, this carries, uh, so we have seen that this carries a group, group of structure. And uh, this group of the structure here is extended to, to this uh, the, uh, dilatation. So you can check this easy by, by the factoriality of this dilatation. So this is, uh, so, yeah, we have seen yesterday that uh, to, to study wide ramification, we, we need to study the, the, the dilatation. So this is uh, the geometric picture of the dilatation. Okay. <clears throat> now, ah. And uh, I, <clears throat> So here, uh, so we have this uh, uh, yes. um, <clears throat> yeah, <laughs> exceptional divisor. And what is the, the, the structure of this X? So in general, uh, yeah. So we have this decision by accessory divisor. So this accessory divisor carries a, uh, is not naturally regarded as a vector bundle <coughs> over D. And this is a vector bundle associated to uh, So the dual of <coughs> uh, omega one uh, with pole uh, of, of multiplicity r along d. So this is this is our setup. Now, so we want to study the covering. So uh, I. So, so let, let me imagine that uh, our k is the fraction field of the Hensel relation. So, so we, are, we want to study finite covering, uh, a fin finite color extension. And the gaza is the direct point of D. So, let, so, so we have X and it contains the complement of D. So we assume that there is a, a finite eta zitosa here. Uh, Galois covering and uh, the normalization. <clears throat> so, so this is uh, we assume this is a norm normalization and I assume that this is uh, smooth and uh, V is a complement of uh, smooth divisor. And uh, our L is the fraction field of the local ring at the at the uh, z point. So after taking uh, <coughs> uh, eternal neighborhood, we may assume that we are in such a situation. Okay, now, <clears throat> so next task, task is, uh, so uh, we have a group of the structure on the first floor, 
And we want to have a group structure also on the, on the second floor. So we take, we have, we take the fiber product <coughs> like this. Then uh, we have a color action of G on V. So we can take the quotient by the diagonal action. <clears throat> and then, so this is a uh, self product. So this carries group of the structure. And this, this one also carries a group of the structure. So to, to see this, so we compute uh, this question product. Then, uh, and this is, uh, so first you take, uh, ah, so, so, <clears throat> sorry, sorry. Uh, so we want to have, have a map here. So, so we want to, yeah. We want to look at the fiber product over. So here a map is induced by S and the map here is induced by, by so S is induced by second projection and induced by first, first projection. So we want to, look compute this, this fiber product. Then, uh, then this will be identified with the quotient of diagonal G cross G and intersection uh, G cross diagonal G. So intersections, of course, taken this uh, triple product and this triple product acts naturally on this triple product. And if you compute carefully, then you get the, this, this, this solution. And, uh, and of course, this intersection is uh, diagonal G in this uh, triple product. So, so in this way, uh, we get the uh, uh, this, this multiplication. So, so not the, 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 the map here is defined by first and the third projection. And uh, this diagonal action is, of course, compatible. So, we get this in this motion. So, in this way, uh, we, 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 we see that this, this guy carries also group of the structure, and this, this is a most of a group, group point. Okay, so this is uh, so far so good. So everything is uh, easier uh, in, on, on this etard part. But now we want to study the ramification. So, so we constructed uh, uh, this group, group of the structure here in, on this dilatation. And this contains uh, U cross U. And uh, we, we have this. Uh, Another uh, group point and uh, most group point. So we want to extend it to here uh, to study the <coughs> ramification. So we put WR here. So what is WR? WR is uh, the So WR is the, the, the largest, largest, uh, <clears throat> largest um, open sub-scheme 
銀座のマガジンでしょユアールオブピアールインディスカファイナルデータカバリング<笑> Yeah, so normalization gives us a finite covering and we, we just, uh, not, not just, uh, for, which is et al over. Yeah. So we just take the et al locus of this finite covering. Then, <clears throat> oh, yeah, I, I can write it here. Um, yeah, I. So here, we, so we have a diagonal here, and uh, we have seen that this is extended there. And also, uh, we have diagonal here. And this u is nothing but uh, v divided by g. So by, by, by functionality, we have a section here. So we wonder if this section here can be extended to zero or not. So, uh, so after shrinking, shrinking, Uh, uh, this, um, so we have thinking x to the open neighborhood. We, we get, uh, 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 uh maybe star exists. So, The final lemma final lemma is that the, uh, so WR is a group point. If and only if uh, X to PR is lifted to WR. So this implication is obvious because to, to have a group of the structure, you, you have to have a diagonal. But uh, you, you can check the, the, the other direction. So this is, these two are in fact equivalent. And, uh, But by the ramification condition, uh, we, 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 we check that, uh, <coughs> this lifting property, and this lifting property gives us this group of the structure, and, uh, I, I will omit the detail, but this group of the structure gives us what we want, so, uh, uh, I, I, I mean, the, this definition of character form. Oh, well, thank you very much. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry? I'm ah, sorry. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so, so we are working, uh, yeah, ne neighborhood of the giant point. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so any other questions or comments? Maybe ask to the room. So, okay, so then uh, from Zoom, uh, yes, please. So, uh, the, the, the fact that star exists locally, is it, uh, this, is, this uses the assumption on the ramification? Yeah, yeah, so. exactly. Yes, this, this uses that uh, GR plus is uh, trivial. Yeah, so you yeah. have to compare this construction with what you did before. Yes, yes, exactly. Yeah. This, this part I didn't explain, but we, so, 
So, so we have uh, this map, and uh, we take uh, uh, base change like this. Then, then we, get, we, 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 we get to this property, so uh, we, we go, up, go back to the original situation. So, so no questions? Okay. So then uh, let's thank the speaker again.